Okay guys, here we have it. This is my first atomic bomb bath and body shop. Bath bomb. This is a bling bomb. We are going to find a pretty little jewel inside here. Whew, it's hot in this bathroom. Okay, this is- HOLY CRAP! Oh my god, I dropped him. My nail pierced through his side, but let's throw him in! Hey! My nail pierced through his side and cracked him. <gasps> oh no! There's my, there's my jewel. See, it's over there. We're gonna get it. Holy crap, this thing is fucking gorgeous. Oh my god, I have to get my nails cut back. Oh my god, I cannot believe I just did that. My nail pierced through him and he cracked. Oh no, okay, always, I'm gonna tell you right now that yes, you have to be very gentle with bath bombs that have, let me grab it real quick. Okay, you have to be extremely gentle with bath bombs that have inserts like this in it, things that like jewelry and stuff, because if you do press it the wrong way, it does separate, because it is not bath bomb in the center, it is, you know, a foreign object, it's plastic, that carries your, your jewel in it, but holy shit, whoa, this thing smells amazing and it's fucking beautiful, hold on, let me see if I can, like, get the camera to, there you go, there you go, guys, now you can see it, look at this, look at this, look at this, now even though, we had a small disaster because, like an idiot, I went to squeeze it tighter and I slipped my fucking nail in it. And I broke it. It still is magnificent. And I gotta say, one of my favorite scents was the sun and sand. Yeah, am I saying that right? Yes, yeah, sun and sand. Let's pop open our plastic and let's see what we got. Urgh. Hold on, I can't pop it with one hand. Give me one second. Got it. Alright. Okay, we have our fun right here. Well, it's not called fun. Let's not get a copyright infringement issue going on here. Uh, it is Play-Doh, and it's just like fun. Ooh, I can't get it out of the package right now because I have one hand, but look at that. Ooh, this is beautiful. I like see, I like see, I like see. That is gorgeous, and look at this fucking water. Okay, now if anybody streams Tammy's videos as much as I do, that's the woman who makes these bath bombs. Her name is Tammy, and the name of the company is Atomic Bomb. See, I already have all the stuff I want to use tonight. I have the Atomic Bomb uh, Secret Garden Soap, which I'm absolutely in love with. The bubblegum scented Play-Doh, which uh, I am so happy to watch Boogie in this, because he will smell like this forever. And then right here, I have the whole box of goodies right next to me. Because I don't know if I'm going to do just one, if I'm going to do two. I mean, who knows? I might do two tonight, because I'm so excited. Excited. And I know we might have to do another one because I done fucked this one up. Now, mind you, that was completely 100% my fault due to I know I have to be gentle with the bombs that have the plastic insert with a ring or something inside of it due to there's nothing sealing it in the center. So in the center of your bomb, you have a hole with something foreign in it. And if I press it the wrong way, it will in my hands. And I slipped this on my other hand, I slipped this nail right in the fucking seam. And it broke on me. Damn it. Anywho, it is still magnificent. And let's show you the big thing. Her bath bombs are called bubble bath bombs. Why? Because if you flick the water on, it will create bubbles. Like a bubble bar. Look at this. All I'm doing is lightly agitating. And it looks blue on camera, but the water is a gorgeous purple. And look, her bath bombs make bubbles. They are bubble bath bombs. That is fucking amazing. Okay, but I'm not gonna do it right now while we're talking. I will just... So I wanna show you is that all her bath bombs are bubble bath bombs. So there you have it. They will make bubbles. Oh my god. Wow, this is like the most moisturizing bath bomb I've ever felt in my fucking life. Oh my god. I'm rubbing it on my leg. Thank god I'm not wearing fucking long pants right now. Oh my god, this feels so good. Wow, holy cow. Look, and I still got some colors back there. Um, I know it looks like blue and murky here, but it's purple in life, like in real life. 
Um, wow, I'm like really... Yeah, it still comes up purple on the camera. I don't know, maybe it's just my phone. Who knows? Whatever you guys are seeing, you guys are seeing, but I see purple. But yeah, all her bath bombs have bubbles, and this is like really fucking moisturizing. This is like, did you ever like shave your legs in a bathtub or something like that? You know, you just put a little drop of water in, and you shave real quick, and then you rinse all the water down, and then you use your bath bomb, whatever it does. This is something that at the end of this bath, I think I'm going to let it drain down just a little bit, and then I'm going to shave in here without using any shaving cream, shaving butters, or shaving oils or anything like that, because you don't need any of it. This is, it is not greasy by any means, but she is using some high quality items in here. She is. She definitely is for it to be this moisturizing, but not greasy. Look, you can see right on the top. Do you see an ounce of grease in here? Like anything, like Little Feather Company had a whole film of oil on top. Do you see any oil anywhere in here? I see no oil, but... Oh, I just dropped a rag in the water. I see no oil whatsoever, but it is the most moisturizing, soft feel on my hand. Like, this is this is outrageous. So I am definitely going to let this, when we we're about to get out, I'm definitely going to let it just go down to about this much. And then I'm going to shave my legs real quick and then rinse everything down. But holy shit, man. This is really nice. And the fucking ring. Wow. Um, let me pause it and get it out of the bag for you. Hang on one second. Okay, we're back. Here you have it. I put it on my fingers that way it didn't get so, like, blurry. Look how fucking pretty that is. That looks a hundred times better than anything I've ever gotten from freaking fragrant jewels. It really does. It looks better quality, better made. It's beautiful. You know something? I want to keep it so bad, but I really think, because House Guest from Hell loves this red stone... I think I might just want to give it to her. But I really want to keep it. <laughs> but I do have two more bling, bomb, bling bombs to do. And then Boogie has his minion bomb that he can do to get his little minion out of it. But this is an absolute beautiful ring. But um, House Guest from Hell's real name is Crystal. And Crystal is in love with this ring. She just ran out of here going, I want it. <laughs> so she's in love with this ring. So I might, might have to part with it. I don't know. I really don't want to, though. I want to keep it. But, holy shit, man. I wish I would have pierced it and we would have gotten a better show out of it. But, unfortunately, like a dumbass, I grabbed it too hard. I mean, hey, I'm human. I make mistakes. Sometimes it happens. Let's now take a look at our Play-Doh dough. Everything that came from her is moisturizing. The bath, the, um, the lip scrub, holy shit, is that moisture. I can't stop rubbing it on my lips. Even this. Like, I've never had Lush send me dough, you know, um, fun. That actually moisturized. This, I ripped a little piece off and just washed my hands with it before. This is moisturizing. This is, Boogie's not going to have any itchies or anything like that on his skin. And I'm going to wash myself with it as well. This is definitely moisturizing. And it has a hint of shimmer in it. Like, uh, like luster. <laughs> I like that word. But anywho, guys. Alright, I'm going to jump in and enjoy my bath. And who knows, I might do another one. I definitely want to do another one. I think I'm going to do another one. Yeah. I'm going to do another one. I just don't know which one I want to do. Okay, but, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do another one. So let me scrub Boogie down in this one because I love this scent. And I want him to smell like our, uh, bubble dough here. I want him to smell like our dough, our soap dough. And I have to get the rest of his duckies. Because all of his duckies have to go in. And look, the bubbles are still staying. As moisturizing and as nice as this water feels, you would think it would have too much oil in it in order to stay, sustain bubble. The fucking bubbles are still here. I still, I haven't even ran it. Like, look how, how low my water is. I haven't even ran it to like bubble it up, so I'm gonna bubble it up. And uh, the, the bubbles haven't disintegrated at all. She's using some expensive product to make this, I'm telling you, man. She's gotta be using like the highest grade butters and friggin' salts and stuff like that because you would normally see a sheen of oil with this type of feel. You gotta get your hands on one. Um, I'm gonna link the Etsy site down below, her Etsy shop. But I'm telling you, um, her Etsy shop doesn't have as much as she has in her warehouse. So definitely talk to her. Get in contact with her through Etsy, through any way you can, through her videos. Get in contact with her and get your hands on this shit immediately. I'm going to link the Etsy site down below. She does have her own channel. Um, it's uh, Atomic Bomb. You can She comments on my videos. You can just see it You know, as you go through and push that picture. And it'll take you right over to her channel. And you can take a look and you can talk to her through there. She's an awesome fucking person. She's extremely down to earth. And, I mean, you know, I bought three bombs from her, and she sent me a whole bunch of goodies to demo for you guys, so you guys could see them, and you guys could get to know her product a little bit, and definitely, 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 you know, she sent me, she sent me way too much, but, uh, 
definitely I am extremely happy. Like, the smells that are in my freaking house right now. I'm not going to be able to collect this stuff because I want to use it so bad. I mean, there's, there's, I'm going to have to order double of everything so I can collect it. Um, uh, I'm going to definitely try and order a double of a couple of things from her on this next order that I'm going to do. It's just way I can do a little giveaway so you guys can try it. Because I know some of you out there don't have the cash to keep, you know, trying products and losing your money because the products aren't good. So I'm going to try and demo and product giveaway as much as I can of, of products that I really believe in. This company, Atomic Bomb, Bath & Body, holy fuck, she's got me sold. I did not think it was going to be this good. I didn't think so. And the lip friggin' scrub, she has a dual set right now. It's on Etsy. It's a lip scrub and a lip butter. Oh my god, I'm buying them. I love them. I, I love the lip scrub. I can't get over how good it feels. I mean, and I'm a smoker, so I have wor the worst fucking dry lip you could think of. I'm always biting the skin off them. Fucking man, oh my god, it was so good. It was so good. And it smells like... I don't know if it's supposed to, but it smells like a box of chocolates to me. That's what it smells like. But, alright, let's throw in our ducky. <laughs> Both of you little bastard. There we go. I chucked in the ducky, but he's got a whole collection of these ducks. Like, I gotta, I gotta one day do a video with all his ducks in here. Uh, you know something? I'm gonna throw them in. I'll throw them in with every single one of his ducks, and then uh, I'll either do a photo on Instagram, or I will film the next bath bomb with all the ducks in the water. But I love you guys, and definitely check Tammy out, man. Atomic Bomb Bath and Body. This is the shit. This is, I'm going to say it now, it is right up there. She runs neck and neck with Lush Bomb Diggy. She's neck and neck right there. I mean, I was completely in love with Bomb Diggy, completely in love with Lush, completely in love with the Mad Bombers, and all the rest of them that I did. I love them. But I my top would have to be... Atomic Bomb, Bomb Diggy, and Lush. Lush is dropping fast. Lush is dropping fast mainly because, for me, I feel like it's all the same, you know? Um, I know in the kitchen this week they're coming out with something new on Wednesday, but it's still all the same base note, base scent. So I'm kind of getting sick of it. I'm kind of getting sick of the fucking pricing, man. You know, I mean, I'm, I'm really getting a little put off by it. But, I, you know, and I love what she stands for. All of her products are cruelty-free, animal cruelty-free, um safe product like they say don't bathe the baby every night but in this type of product i can bathe the baby every night and none of his skin would dry out this is the most moisturizing bath bomb i've ever felt in my goddamn life and in my 34 years and in my last year of doing all these bath bombs and everything like that i've gone through some some hefty bath bombs this is the most moisturizing i've ever felt i'm in love with this uh, i'm definitely doing another one though so i'm gonna grab bug i'm gonna scrub him up real quick Enjoy a little bit of this one. Um, sneak my mommy's cigarette in the bathtub because I know I'm not allowed to smoke in the house. And uh, then I am going to do another one. So I'll be back in a little bit with another video, guys. Love yous all.